The audit will begin in Nairobi and not just in Isili alone, but the entire city and its suburbs. According to the Internal Security Minister, the number of foreigners arrested for property fraud and money laundering is on the rise and a cause for alarm. We have arrested several people trying to cross into Kenya and ask them to go back, especially when we discover they are not genuine uh, people, people who are coming to seek a refugee status. I think the other issue I wanted to comment, uh, uh, our chief guest, is the issue, you know, the, we had an operation this weekend, yes, and I saw it reported in the media, but it is, it is not an operation just on Syria alone. There are allegations that Somali pirates are using Kenyan's property market as a source of cleaning their dirty money attained from ransoms, a trend that, if continued, could hurt the Kenyan economy in the near future. The audits will be conducted by provincial commissioners who will report to the internal security minister on who owns what. We will be working with the Minister of Lands at least to, to document who owns what in this country and from which country. And that will be done very, we will be, I'm sure the minister will be giving very clear uh, standards on how that action will be done. But we have received very, very many representations by Kenyans that we should get to know who owns what, especially when it comes to issues of money laundering or people bringing in money that are dirty and cleaning it in this country. The land ministry has been urged to come up with stringent measures in property acquisition in order to put an end to the vice. The PS also refuted claims that top officials in Kenya were hosting Rwandese fugitive Felician Kabuga. And saying that Kenya doesn't cooperate on that issue. And yet we have cooperated fully, fully on issues of tracing and tracking down uh, this fugitive. And you see, if a fugitive came and it is termed that he came into this country. It is very difficult for him to say, now I want to leave the country, especially when he, when he escaped. It would be very difficult for him to go to the immigration and say, I'm Kabuga, I want to leave the country, so can you stand my documents? Kimemia was speaking in Nairobi during the commissioning of newly appointed district commissioners. Catherine Omwando, KTM Prime.